WrestleCrap Radio. Hey, hey, everybody. How you doing, Penis? Well, uh, oh, I'm a little bit down right now. You're a little bit down. Sin Cara's penis is down dot com. I bet that URL is not taken. Now, now, penis. Uh, excuse me, Sin Cara's penis. Uh, um, this is obviously your big breakout moment. Uh, how long have you actually been in the WWE? I've been with them for about 25 years now, honestly. Uh, time out! Time out! <laughs> okay. There have been some absurd things on this show in the last six years or whatever. We can let the guy finish. He's having the worst No, I'm life. not. I. Psst, no. <laughs> Russell Crap Radio. How you doing tonight, Dale? Terrible. Oh, everything's terrible for you? What about me? It's always terrible for you. Goddamn right it is. <laughs> they repossessed my, uh, my, my, my barbecue. Remember when I used to have that lawn mowing barbecue thing? <laughs> right, yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> me, and, me and Hollywood John would show up in the summertime and I'd show up with my grill, and immediately Hollywood John would start mowing your lawn. By the time Hollywood John got done mowing your lawn, I'd be done smoking you some burger. Wow, I can't believe that failed. Anyway, I was out there, I just had to throw a barbecue grill in the back of my trailer. Right, so you were selling barbecue at the Walmart in Tulsa. Yeah, that's right, I didn't have a permit, and they arrested me. Oh, that's unfortunate. Uh, uh, you're just, uh, fuck yourself. <laughs> Jim. Jim. Jim, Hello? that's not, that's not good, Jim. Oh. He seemed rather erratic. <laughs> I, you know, people, I get worried about people, do, you know, they say a holiday depression. <laughs> I don't even, he was talking, well, I don't understand what his, his business model was there at all. <laughs> His brain was like misfiring on like fifteen different points. Happy holidays! Uh, Happy I didn't holidays! Hello, everyone. This is your Action News reporter with all the news that is news across the nation on the scene at the supermarket. There seems to have been some disturbance here. Pardon me, sir. Did you see what happened? Yeah, I did. I was standing over by the tomatoes, and here it comes. Oh! Been too long! Listen to how festive it is. It wasn't festive when I went out to Black Friday. I actually went out to Black Friday for the first time. Well, we'll, we will, we'll get to that. Okay. Lots to discuss. <laughs> this it, is your, for, this for, is our WrestleMania moment. For newer listeners, we need to explain it. Okay. There was once a time when I thought the show was going to be about pro wrestling. It quickly, quickly became obvious. That's not what people want to hear about. They want to hear about R.D. Reynolds. Oh, yeah. Get it cranking. Get those, get those bells jingling. They want to hear about R.D. Reynolds going to the grocery. They want to hear about R.D. Reynolds going to the library. And most of all... They want to hear about me taking a shit in the trash bag? They want to hear about R.D. Reynolds' trip to Black Friday. Do not ever, ever get a shopping cart on Black Friday. It's Why? death. You can't maneuver. Mm. When you are in these stores, they're completely crowded. You can't maneuver. Have you ever thought about using shopping carts to your benefit to kind of use them? You know, like it's to, funny you to, mention that. That's what someone in the store decided to do. Okay. Who I will lovingly refer to from this moment forward as shopping cart girl. 
She used the shopping cart to her benefit. Right. See if I can explain this. I don't know if perhaps she had issues with her legs. Um, you mean like crippled? Perhaps. That's why I didn't want to bring it up. <laughs> so I knew that that's like feeding a, a hungry dog. Oh, real quick, time out, time out, time out. Um, uh, like, I don't mean to interrupt you, but... Uh, yeah, you could, uh, could, you, could you not? Uh, we're we're, we're talking about wheelchairs. So I can, um, so I can as, finish as you, my you, story. Okay, finish your story. No, just go ahead. No, finish no, your story. You, you, you've ruined the moment. Finish your story. Well, no, forget it. Finish your fucking story or I'll leash ten fucking F-bombs right the fuck away. I'd get a lot more money that way. What about this woman in a cart, shopping cart lady? I know. I want to hear about the woman in the with the person in the wheelchair. No, we just because, uh, as you may know, I I was out filming with the video camera. I was mm-hmm. I was in the midnight rose, and I had Stubby with me, and you had you had uh, uh, Mama Mrs. Deal. Mm-hmm. Well, I had the Black Friday Scorpion with. Right. Anyway, I saw a guy in a wheelchair. Mm-hmm. And I just, I didn't have the heart in me to have Stubby ask him if he could have a reach, hitch a ride. I had a moment, I had a moment of G-rated, non-explicit blade. You, you were going to have Stubby say what? I was going to have Stubby say, say ask the guy for a ride on his lap. Now continue about your shopping cart, lady. I don't know if she didn't have full use of her legs, but yeah. she was uh, she was sitting in the shopping cart, like literally sitting in it with legs extended in the shopping cart. Ooh, legs extended. That no. sounds kind of hot. No, it, no. Dude, it's a girl at Black Friday in a shopping cart at a Walmart. Yeah. How does that about. sound appealing in any way, shape, or form? You don't know my standards. Well, then let me tell you about how she maneuvered. <laughs> you were talking about how you should use the shopping cart to your advantage. I think this woman was the epitome of that. She okay. was laying in the shopping cart. Oh. With her back <laughs> to the, the gynecologist's the... office. What? Yes. Yes. She didn't have her feet up out of the shopping cart. <laughs> well, like well, she was at the OBGYN. Yeah, Walmart only has a few of shopping carts with stirrups. <laughs> yeah, not a lot. And those were, on, those were in uh, short supply. <laughs> so she's sitting in the shopping cart. And she... Is again. You have to think about this. Her back is. You know they have the the, the fold out thing so that the kids can sit in the shopping cart. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about. That was folded up, obviously, and she had her back all the way to the back. So her back's against the back, and then her her feet are are going straight up to the front, right? Are Without you the sure? stirrups. Are you sure somebody just some Black Friday customer just didn't slip her a roofie and thought no. she was a she well, was a she was a, a sex slave. Oh. Because <laughs> <laughs> how could she? How could she maneuver? Well, I'm glad you asked. Maybe you won't interrupt this time, and I can finish the story. <clears throat> so she had her arms out. Her arms could work. I knew, I was able to figure that out. Because what she did is she would reach out of the cart, and let's say there was a a, a, a rack of, of jeans or whatever. Oh, wow. Okay. She would hold on to that and then pull herself and the whole cart forward. Wow. That would have been odd enough with her pulling herself along like it was a little boat. 
Like it was a little boat that she was in, maneuvering around shopping, uh, maneuvering around uh, Walmart. Okay? Been odd enough, right? But here was the kicker. As she was going along, she, it wasn't just her in the shopping cart. I hope, please, please, I hope she was kind of semi-retarded and grunted while all this was going on. I, well, I'll get to that. <laughs> As she was going along, it wasn't just her in the shopping cart. Like, if there was something she wanted to purchase, okay, she threw it in the shopping cart on top of herself. <laughs> And I was like, I had my phone with me, right? Right. And I was like, oh, man, I am getting a picture of this because no one will believe me. So I got it out, and I, I had the, the, the camera all set up. When along came this very surly-looking gentleman with her, mm -hmm. and he just kind of went, <laughs> And I was like, oh, look at that text. It's from Blade. <laughs> So now tell us about your exploits. Well, I'm a rookie at all this mm -hmm. stuff. Um, so I, uh, uh, and the, you can find all this stuff on YouTube, by the way. I rounded up Stubby. I rounded up the Black Friday Scorpion. We just went out to get into some madness. <clears throat> and uh, basically, uh, I was... Uh, 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 we were just kind of surveying the scene. We really didn't want to buy anything. I just wanted to, just wanted to um, um, hit on hot girls, basically. Yeah, I did see <laughs> in, in the video someone was yelling at you or something. What was that? Oh, about? that's right. That's right. Yes. Uh, of course, you know the Midnight Rose was out there, and of course he was dropping f bombs. And I swear to God, you're, uh, I was like, and I'm going to, I'm going to say what I said here. I was like, you know, like, uh, we got to go back to, we got to go to the back of the fucking line. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden I hear this fat woman from like half a football field away. She's like, Hey, Hey, we got kids over here. Watch your mouth. <laughs> Parents of the year with their kids out there at, uh, 10 at night. Oh, it was really cold, too. Mm -hmm. I, I saw lots of people cold. And there were really, there were a lot of dickheads out, if, if, if I may be blunt. And you'll see it on the video. I, uh, but, I, you know, there was a... <laughs> Time what? out. What? So you're out there with the Midnight Rose wearing a, a, a mask that covers the Midnight Rose's entire face. Right. With the Black Friday Scorpion yeah, with see. an outfit that covers... His entire face. Right. You're walking around with a ventriloquist dummy. Right. But you, but you, but the other people were the, if I can may be so blunt, dickheads. That's right. I we just want to make sure that I'm following along. That's all right, because uh, there was, uh, there was, uh, there was, uh, I was, I was, my Black Friday deal of the night mm -hmm. was, uh, I actually, um, I have found a, um, a, a mother and daughter. Right. And they, and the, they the mother and daughter were the deal of the night? They both fell in love with the Midnight Rose. Oh, wow. Yes. Yeah. So, Who yeah, was I the found, little kid that you kept yelling at? There was some little kid. He, he uh, uh, Stubby was just trying to ask this little kid uh, about Adderall. Because you know these kids these days. They have all, all hopped up on Adderall and stuff. Sure. Just go type in um, uh, Midnight Rose Black Friday on YouTube. There'll be a two-minute preview video and a much longer one where um, where we get threatened, where we get no-sold, where we get told to go to hell, where um, uh, where a MILF uh, tells me tells the Midnight Rose that she's glad her husband didn't show up because she uh, obviously has the hots for the Midnight Rose. Wow. So there you go. And by the way, you and everybody else that do that uh, unmasked and without ventriloquist dummies are batshit crazy. No.